All right, so we have a Yi Link T56. This would also work with a T58 uh, Skype edition. And I was completely banging my head on how to reset this because somebody um, had it set up for um, the previous had it had a different username and password for the um, admin section here and it wouldn't let you in. So went round and round looked over i couldn't find out how to reset this because i want to use sip on it um so i'm going to tell you the whole process on how to do it so first you get the mac address which is going to be right there open up a ticket with e-link support tell them that you want to convert it to sip they will email you a license file or, you know, or put it in the ticket, right? And then if your phone, you need to factory reset it to get into it, you got to hold down the pound and the star button or asterisk. And then it asks you if you want to reset the factory and bam there you go reset to factory so that takes a second or two to run through once that is done we'll come back to it okay once it's done resetting now we will be able to get into the web GUI. And it's username admin admin. And once that comes up, you want to go to security. And then you want to upload the SIP license file that they sent you. And once we find that, hit browse, and then you're going to come over here and and make sure it matches up. You know, the MAC address is a match up. Click on the license. And then we can upload it. Say yes. So once it does its reboot, it should come back up and have that SIP license in it. Once it has its SIP license, then you're going to be able to go to settings and upload the SIP firmware. We'll do that in a second once it reboots. All right, we go to eLink support, download the SIP version, latest version 58. 830 15 ROM. Save that. And then, make sure we got it. Yep. Go back to your phone. Go to the upgrade section here under settings. And then we grab that version of it and upload. And. Get some firmware update action. Make this bad boy into a SIP phone machine. Oh, and voila. Now we're seeing Android upgrade action. And bam. We now have a full on SIP compliant Yeelink. T56A. This will also work for the T58A. I assume also the ones with the video camera too. And look at all that wonder, wonder, awesome stuff.
All right. Well, I hope this helps somebody out. Cheers. And please subscribe. I'm trying to get a thousand users someday. Thanks again.